While the beginning of July always sees Independence Day celebrations across America, it also marks the beginning of the Calgary Stampede. Known as the greatest outdoor show on earth, this 10-day festival sees hundreds of thousands of people from around the world flock into Calgary to take in this one-of-a-kind event. The Calgary Stampede has been running strong for over a century, but how does such a storied and long-lived festival get its start? So hilariously for being in Canada, it was an American showman who had the idea for this stampede, Guy Wiedek. And he was with the Miller Brothers and he traveled all over Canada and the United States uh, and into Europe and he was in Calgary in 1908. And he said Calgary is this perfect place to hold a Frontier Day celebration, he called it. So he tried in 1908 to get some backers, but the time wasn't right. He came back in 1912 and pitched it all around town with very little success until George Lane. George Lane was in fact an American transplant himself. A well-accomplished cattleman, Lane was a true visionary, not only bringing technological innovations to the area, but his civic-mindedness helped grow the region. And so George Lane effectively sort of summoned Guy Wiedek and said, let's hear your pitch, what's your idea? So Wiedek said, you know, we want to hold this Frontier Day celebration with real rodeo, uh, with the best cowboys in North America. We're going to offer the most money of any rodeo, and we're going to celebrate this West. And Lane said, I love it. Lane, with the help of three of his fellow Alberta ranchers, Patrick Burns, A.E. Cross, and A.J. McLean, financially backed Wiedek's plan, and the stampede was born. The men would forever be known as the Big Four from that point on. Activities and work and desire and drive by somebody like George Lane, that stays in the fabric of your organization a hundred years and uh, the Stampede's known as a can-do attitude and that came from our original founders and George Lane has certainly had that attitude. When I think about the lasting impact of George Lane and the Big Four, um, I think about the um, community vision they had. Everyone recognizes that Guy Wiedek, uh, you know, the promoter of the first time, he had a vision for the festival. Um, I think the Big Four and, and George Lane really had a vision for what that festival would do for the community. George Lane's ability to recognize the potential in Guy Wiedek's vision has led to an annual huge financial boom to the city of Calgary while exposing people from around the globe to the Western way of life. It was because of this and his many other accomplishments towards the preservation of Western heritage that George Lane was inducted into the Hall of Great Westerners in 2016 here at the National Cowboy Museum. The Calgary Stampede is definitely bucket list worthy. And to find out more about George Lane and the Hall of Great Westerners, please visit our website at nationalcowboymuseum.org.